A sticky situation. The commonality of excess throat mucus. We've all been there at some point in our lives. That annoying tickle in the back of your throat that just won't go away. The constant need to clear your throat, which can be both irritating and embarrassing. That sticky, gooey feeling that just won't go away, no matter how much you try to clear it. Excess throat mucus is a common problem that can be incredibly frustrating and uncomfortable. It's important to understand that mucus itself isn't a bad thing. In fact, it's essential for our health. Mucus plays a crucial role in protecting our bodies by trapping dust, bacteria, and other harmful particles. It acts as a sticky trap, catching irritants before they can reach our lungs and cause infections. Additionally, mucus helps to keep our nasal passages and throats moist, preventing dryness and irritation. However, when we produce too much mucus, or when it becomes too thick, it can lead to significant discomfort and even health problems. This essay will explore the common causes of excess throat mucus, such as allergies, infections, and environmental factors, and provide practical tips on how to manage it effectively. By understanding the reasons behind your symptoms and making simple lifestyle changes, you can find relief from that sticky situation and breathe easier. Let's dive in and learn more about how to tackle this common issue. Unmasking the culprit allergies as a leading cause. Allergies are more common than many people realize and can significantly impact daily life. One of the most common culprits behind excessive throat mucus is allergies. This can be particularly troublesome during certain seasons or in specific environments. When we encounter an allergen, such as pollen, dust mites, or pet dander, our immune system overreacts. This overreaction is the body's way of trying to protect us, but it often causes more harm than good. This immune response triggers the release of histamine and other chemicals that cause inflammation in the nasal passages and throat. Histamine is a key player in the allergic response, leading to many of the symptoms we experience. This inflammation leads to increased mucus production as the body tries to flush out the allergen. The excess mucus can be bothersome and persistent. Allergy sufferers often experience symptoms like a runny nose, sneezing, itchy eyes, and of course, that dreaded post-nasal drip. These symptoms can vary in intensity and duration. Post-nasal drip occurs when excess mucus from the nasal passages drips down the back of the throat, causing that sticky, uncomfortable sensation. This can lead to coughing and throat irritation. If you suspect allergies might be the root of your mucus woes, it's essential to identify your triggers. Knowing what causes your symptoms is the first step in managing them effectively. Keeping a diary of your symptoms and the environments you're exposed to can be helpful. This can provide valuable insights into patterns and potential triggers. Once you know what you're allergic to, you can take steps to avoid those triggers. This might involve making changes to your home environment or daily routine to minimize exposure. Battling bugs infections and their contribution to mucus overload. Another common cause of excess throat mucus is infection. Infections can be caused by various pathogens, including bacteria, viruses, and even fungi. When we get sick with a cold, the flu, or other respiratory infections, our bodies produce more mucus to fight off the invading viruses or bacteria. This is a natural response to help trap and eliminate these harmful invaders. This mucus is thicker than usual and often has a yellow or green tinge, indicating the presence of white blood cells battling the infection. The color change is a sign that your immune system is actively working to clear the infection. While this increased mucus production is a natural part of our body's defense mechanism, it can be quite uncomfortable. The excess mucus can lead to a feeling of congestion and pressure in the respiratory tract. The thick mucus can clog up our nasal passages and throat, making it difficult to breathe and swallow. This can also lead to a persistent cough as the body tries to clear the mucus. Viral infections are the most common cause of these symptoms, and they typically resolve on their own within a week or two. Rest, hydration, and over-the-counter medications can help alleviate the discomfort during this period. However, if your symptoms are severe, persist for more than 10 days, or are accompanied by a high fever, it's crucial to see your doctor to rule out any bacterial infections that may require antibiotics. Early medical intervention can prevent complications and promote faster recovery. Lifestyle choices, how everyday habits can make it worse. While allergies and infections are common culprits behind excess throat mucus, several lifestyle factors can also contribute to the problem. 
one of the biggest offenders is smoking. Cigarette smoke contains thousands of harmful chemicals that irritate the delicate lining of the respiratory tract. This irritation triggers increased mucus production as the body tries to protect itself from the damaging effects of smoke. Quitting smoking is one of the best things you can do for your overall health, and it can significantly reduce mucus production. Other lifestyle factors that can contribute to excess mucus include exposure to irritants like dust, fumes, and dry air. Making simple changes like using air purifiers, humidifiers, and avoiding smoky environments can make a big difference in managing your symptoms. Section 5. The Power of Hydration, Fighting Mucus with Fluids Now that we've explored some of the common causes of excess throat mucus, let's dive into some practical tips for managing and reducing it. One of the simplest yet most effective strategies is staying hydrated. Drinking plenty of fluids, especially water, helps to thin the mucus, making it easier to clear from your throat. Think of it like this. Thick, sticky mucus is like trying to move a heavy piece of furniture across a dry floor. It's much easier to move that same furniture if you add some lubrication. Water acts as a lubricant for mucus, helping it to flow more easily and preventing it from clogging up your throat. Aim to drink at least eight glasses of water throughout the day, and consider carrying a reusable water bottle with you as a reminder to stay hydrated. Section 6. Clearing the Air Environmental Control for Mucus Relief As we mentioned earlier, environmental irritants can exacerbate mucus production. Taking steps to control your environment can go a long way in reducing your symptoms. If you're allergic to dust mites, for example, make sure to wash your bedding regularly in hot water and vacuum your floors frequently. Using dust mite-proof covers for your mattress and pillows can also help. Dry air can also irritate the nasal passages and throat, leading to increased mucus production. Using a humidifier, especially during the winter months when the air tends to be drier, can add moisture to the air and help to thin the mucus. Section 7. Dietary Adjustments – Foods that Help and Hinder Mucus Production Believe it or not, your diet can also play a role in mucus production. Some foods can actually worsen mucus production, while others can help to thin it out and make it less bothersome. Dairy products, for example, are known to increase mucus production in some people. If you notice that your symptoms worsen after consuming dairy, you may want to consider reducing your intake or trying dairy-free alternatives. On the other hand, spicy foods can actually help to thin out mucus. Spicy foods contain capsaicin, a compound that has been shown to have mucolytic properties, meaning it helps to break down mucus. So, if you're a fan of spicy food, don't be afraid to indulge in moderation. Just be sure to drink plenty of water to stay hydrated. Section 8. Natural Remedies – Exploring Home Remedies for Throat Mucus In addition to lifestyle modifications and dietary adjustments, several natural remedies can provide relief from excess throat mucus. Gargling with salt water is a simple yet effective way to soothe a sore throat and help to clear out mucus. Simply mix a teaspoon of salt with a cup of warm water and gargle for 30 to 60 seconds, then spit out the water and repeat as needed. Another natural remedy that can be helpful is steam inhalation. Adding a few drops of essential oils like eucalyptus or peppermint oil to a bowl of hot water and inhaling the steam can help to open up the nasal passages and loosen mucus. Just be careful not to get too close to the hot water and always supervise children when using essential oils. Section 9. When to seek help. Recognizing the signs of a serious condition. While excess throat mucus is usually nothing to worry about, it's essential to be aware of the signs that may indicate a more serious condition. If your symptoms are severe, persist for more than 10 days or are accompanied by other concerning symptoms like fever, chills, difficulty breathing, or chest pain. It's crucial to seek medical attention immediately. These symptoms could indicate a more serious infection or other medical condition that requires prompt treatment. Your doctor can perform a physical exam, order any necessary tests, and recommend the appropriate course of treatment. Section 10. Reclaiming Your Throat – A Path to Less Mucus and More Comfort Dealing with persistent throat mucus can be incredibly frustrating, but it doesn't have to control your life. By understanding the common causes, making simple lifestyle changes, and exploring natural remedies, you can find relief and reclaim your throat. Remember to stay hydrated, avoid triggers like smoke and allergens, consider dietary adjustments, and try natural remedies like gargling with salt water and steam inhalation. 
If your symptoms are severe or persist despite your best efforts, don't hesitate to consult with a healthcare professional. By taking a proactive approach to managing excess throat mucus, you can breathe easier, feel more comfortable, and enjoy life to the fullest. Section 11, a final word, empowering you to take control of your health. Knowledge is power, and by arming yourself with information about excess throat mucus, you're taking an important step towards better health. Remember, you're not alone in this. Millions of people experience the discomfort of excess throat mucus, and there are effective ways to manage and reduce it. By incorporating the tips and strategies outlined in this essay, you can find relief, improve your quality of life, and breathe easier. Your health is your most valuable asset, so take control today and experience the freedom of a mucus-free life.